Hello guys, good evening. Good evening. How are you tonight? Hello teacher, fine. Great, great. Great to hear. Many are we? We are eleven already. Okay, please turn on your camera and make sure you have your full name. Everybody's coming. Let's just wait a few seconds for the rest. Okay, that's good enough. We are 15, so let's start the class. Let me do the attendance. Please turn on your cameras. Cameras open, please. Ada Susena Cáceres Mendoza. Present, teacher. Thank you. Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. Present. Good. Carla Ivania Cabrera Serrano. Carlos Armando Duarte. Claudia Maricela Solano Crespín. Elvin Arcides Eguizabal Martínez. Fátima Ifegenia López Ramos. Present. Thank you. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Isela Liliana Miranda Espinosa. Present. José Antonio Cubillas Hernández. Present. Carla Janet Amaya Herrera. Present, teacher. Miguel Ángel Paz Landa Verde. Present. Miriam Carolina Mozo Valdés. Present. René Alfonso Madrid Escalante. Rina Marisabel Álvarez de Chávez. Roberto Luis Umaña Orellana. Sabrina Mabel Latín Castro. Present teacher. Thank you. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present. Thank you. William Alexander Ramirez Flores. Present. Thank you. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Thank you. Alan Christopher Abrego Brizuela. Carolina Yvette Romero Avelino. Present. Johnny Vladimir Portillo Chávez. Present teacher. Good. Jose Alfredo Sandoval Sarabia. Jose Ángel Martínez Hernández. Juan Marcos Guzmán. Okay, Juan Marcos is not here. Miriam, si está ahí. Alan, welcome, Alan. Okay, René is there as well. Chicos, recuerden present, que si, si no me dicen present, eh, no, no cuento la asistencia, no les estoy viendo cuando paso la asistencia, ok? And please, let's have our full name on the screen, please. Help you. Ok. There we go. Ok, let's start the class. So, what, where were we, guys? Help me, where were we? Actually, you said that today is going to, you're going to perform two groups. Yes, the two missing groups are going to perform today. <laughs> Good. So, so, if you're ready. Sorry, but not sorry. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no, no, it's okay. Um, so the last group, yesterday's group, last group. Who were they? Who remembers? Who was part of the last group yesterday? OK, 
okay, if you don't want to talk, I can take a look at the video really quick. Give me a minute and find out who was on the group yesterday. Okay, who was on the group yesterday? We. <laughs> We with the first presentation. With the first presentation. Okay. Thank you, Jocelyn. Who, who is in your group, Jocelyn? Um, I didn't remember. I guess William. Me, Carolina. Ah, yes. And Alan. Okay. Are you ready? Yes, we are. Okay. Go ahead. Okay, um, hi guys, you know what? I want to quit, I am really tired. I have been working too much. Hi, Jocelyn, sorry to hear that. Hope you are well, uh, but it wouldn't be better if you talk to your friend from the college to see if he has a vacancy in his company so you can have something mm -hmm. safe before you quit. Yes, William, you are right. Carolina? It couldn't be, uh, Jocelyn, it couldn't be better if you already have a secure vacancy, or it could be better if you analyze the salary, the place, salary conditions. Think about it, Jocelyn. Yes. Thank you, Carolina. Oh, come on, come on, again. Did you yeah, just start with the, idea, your, with the idea to quit of your, come on. Who in the heaven doesn't like to be like you in the world, trying best all day long? That's amazing. No, come on. It will be better if you think twice. Come on. Oh, tell me, you are continue with the idea to be a streamer on, I am only fans? thinking to open an OnlyFans account. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> the problem is that I am not too hot and I need oh. to get good photos, you know. Oh, it, it will be better if you think it, you get a manager. Maybe we can be, we can support you, William. <laughs> William will be my manager. Mm. Yeah. Why not? Good idea. Yes, good not? idea. <laughs> yeah, sure, no problem. <laughs> very, okay. very common, and get, you can get a lot of money. Mm. Do you want yeah. to be with me too? <laughs> <laughs> oh, why not? <laughs> yes, why not? You are too pretty. Okay. Anyway, you do. It's over. Bye, guys. Bye. I guess yeah. I'm going to open my OnlyFans account. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Oh my God. Okay. Good. Repeat. Tired. 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 Mm. Tired. 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 There you go. Tired. 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 Perfect. Yeah. Uh, Jocelyn? Uh, tired. Better. Tired. Thank you. Um, en esa palabra, ya les he dicho, necesito que la R enrollen la lengua hasta atrás. Lo más que puedan. Y mientras la sueltan, pronuncian la D. ¿Ok? Tired. 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 Se dice tired como llanta, right? Tired. Pero la D al final es la que hace la diferencia. Tired. The tired. Es como decir taller en español. Pero... Yeah, tired. tired. Sí, pero no tan fuerte. Ajá, tired. Ajá. Tired. Tired. Ah, tired. Tired. Ahí está. Perfecto. Yeah. Tired. 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 Oh, sí. Tired. Eh, y um, la estructura que estamos viendo no es eh, it wouldn't be better, sino si es pregunta es wouldn't it, wouldn't it, mm -hmm. wouldn't it be better? Wouldn't it be better if you talk to your friend? Okay. Y no era, it could be better. Muy bien utilizado, Karina. Solo que es, it will be better. It will be better. It will be better. 
Um, it could be better. Yes, you can use it as a suggestion as well. And good, good grammar. You are continue with the idea. Do you continue with the idea? Esta es una área que ya habíamos visto, vale, una área de oportunidad. El uso del verbo to be en lugar del auxiliar do. Do you continue with the idea of? Okay. And it's a okay. question, right? Yeah, but I'm, I actually I'm, I'm out of my, I, I try to get the, the idea of the class because I came late and I, what are you talking about? It says like, you were what? improvising. <laughs> yeah. <Okay. laughs> it's okay. Don't worry, but you were speaking and that's the important part. Thank you. <clears throat> Thank you. Okay. So yesterday's group, do you remember? Who was at yes, last? Me, too. <laughs> me. Who who are we? Uh, with Rene. Um, Sandra and Sandra. Johnny. Johnny. Okay. Carolina, Johnny, Rene, Sandra. Okay, I'm sorry, I was just checking. Okay. Good, okay. Ready, whenever you are. Go ahead. Okay. Hello, everybody. I'm gonna, I'm gonna start with training. Uh, it is important, uh, it is important train. I have seen on a training on social media uh, but you need to have a little introduction uh, about the first, about addressing customers. Uh, you know, as you know, greet the guests, say your name, uh, friendly smile, ask about how many, how many guests and the table number. What do you think? Uh, training uh, wouldn't be better in only write the order take order yeah only write the order oh no no it's, it could be it's so difficult to talk with the customer uh, oh no no please it could be better uh, to say hello say please say your name Carolina, what can you tell me about the dress code? Uh, yes, that's another point in, in dress code. If you, in, in this case, if you are a wait, waitress, waiter, uh, it, could be, it could be better to have three or five, four sets of uniforms. Okay, um, will, will we buy the uniform? Oh, no, no, the company will pay, will pay for, for the uniforms. Don't worry about that. And as you know, uh, the, then another point is the, um, the, the waiter, uh, wear white shirt, black, black pen and shoes. It, it many, it, it can, it may differ uh, from restaurant to restaurant. I have a question. Uh, why it is important to place a table? Yes, uh, about setting, setting a table. Uh, it is important, uh, for example, place uh, play, place the dinner uh, dish uh, in the center. The order about utensils, knife, spoon, glass. Do you have another question? I have a question, trainer. And with the dress, and we can use uh, uh, shoes, a uh, black shoes, or we can use another color. Um, in this in this restaurant, is generally black shoes. Only black shoes. Okay. 
Okay. Uh, thanks for coming, guys. That's it. Okay. Good job. I need your help here. Let's correct this really quick. So let's take a few seconds, okay? It is important to, it is important train. Remember, always separate the verbs. It is important to train, okay? It is important to train, um, to train you guys, okay? To be trained, okay? Es importante ser entrenado. It is important to be trained. Y esa sí es la voz pasiva, to be trained. Okay, repeat, greet. 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 Great. Great. There you go. Name. Name. Yeah. Don't forget that. Name. 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 Oh. Yep. Mm, name. Mm, mm. Okay. Trainer. Repeat. Johnny. Trainer. Trainer. And then Trainer. practice this. Wouldn't it be better? Wouldn't it be better mm -hmm. if we... Wouldn't it be wouldn't it be better? Uh huh. Wouldn't, wouldn't it be better? Be better? Wouldn't it be better? Wouldn't, wouldn't it be better? Wouldn't it be better? Better. Be better. There you go. Better. Okay. Just write better. the order. Just write the order. If we just write the order, okay. Wouldn't it be better if we just write the order? That sounds really nice. Thank you. Just the pronunciation, okay? Trainer. Um, what can you tell me? That sounded like can and is can, okay? What can you tell me about, beautiful question, great question. What can you, can you tell me about? What can you tell me about? Sandra? What can, can, can. Can, can. Be careful with that, yeah. Will we bat the uniform, Sandra, and buy the uniforms? Will we buy the uniforms? Will we buy the uniforms? Buy. Buy. Will we buy the, the uniforms? Will we buy the uniforms? Will we buy the uniforms? Uniforms. Uniforms. Better. Uniforms. 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 Okay. The waiter wears... Carolina, you missed the, oh, the S, third yeah, person. The waiter, the waiter wears. Now, ahora, cuando generalizo, chicos, y esto va para todos, porque todos estamos haciendo esto, cuando generalizo no ocupo el artículo the, ¿ok? Entonces quito el the y digo, waiters wear, waiters wear the same uniform, waiters wear black shoes in this restaurant, in general, waiters and waitresses wear black shoes in this restaurant. Why, y esto es algo bien común, ojo, why it is important to place a table. ¿Alguien me ayuda ahí? ¿Qué pasó con esa pregunta? ¿Qué es lo que hay que corregir? Is why? it? Is it? Is it? Very good. Why is it important? Why is it? Why is it important? Why is it important? Why is it important to place a table? Es bien común que pongas eh, de esa manera primero el sujeto y después el auxiliar que estás ocupando, que es el verbo to be. Ante todo con el verbo to be. Cuando me preguntas, ¿está bien decir esto así? Siempre me dicen, it is okay to say this this way. Mm. Is it? Is it okay to say? ¿Ves? Es bien fácil equivocarse ahí. Is it? Is it okay? Is it okay? Okay. Good. Um, the order about utensils, the order of the utensils on the table is very important. The order. Um, do you have another questions? Otra área de oportunidad bien común en intermedio ante todo. Another, singular. Other, plurals. I repeat, another, singular. Other, plurals. Okay. You got it? Do you have another question? Do you have another question? Do you have other questions? Do you have other questions? Okay. Um, y la muletilla, Jenny. Uh, black shoes, se ve como a black shoes. Mm, un zapatos azules. Mm -hmm. 
Yep, everybody, just be careful. Eso es bien como ahorita, pero we can correct that easily. Okay, let's start. And to move on, we continue speaking about this structure. So you have two options, just two options right now that we are practicing, okay? An affirmative way of speaking. Okay. An affirmative way of speaking, starting with a subject, it, okay? Start with a subject. Then you say would, which by the way is would, 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 okay? Then you have a base verb in this case, be, okay? Better, which is the comparative form of good, right? And then we have an infinitive to let, okay? And then the complement. So again, subject, modal, base verb, comparative, and infinitive. Okay, so let's stick to it. Let's stick to the plan. You understand that? Let's let's stick to, to the plan. Can we stick to the plan? Yeah. Okay, let's stick to the structure here. It would be better to, okay, or the second option. Oh, look, there's another way. Okay, other expressions uh, to provide suggestions. Other expressions to provide suggestions will be Look at the structure again. So it's not written in rock, you know, but you have a subject, the model and be better, and then the infinitive. So would you prefer to? Wouldn't it be better to? It will be good if, oh, so I can replace better with good. Okay, it will be good if, okay. It will be good if we had a professional to complete the manual. Okay. Do you still have questions? Okay. I want you to use this structure and let's have a discussion in the class. Okay, follow me. You know, guys, um, in seven years teaching, I've learned that it's better to have students speaking and the teacher only correcting, okay? But sometimes I think it's good to have the teacher speaking the whole class. What do you think? Is it better to have the teacher speaking the whole class? No, I look, no I because- Apply the grammar. Apply the grammar. Okay. <laughs> Give me suggestions. Come on. It will be good if we speak more. In that case, we can uh, correct our mistakes. Yeah. Okay. It would, really? It would be better to, to be corrected be and learn about it. Totally. Johnny? In the space. It would be better to give the space to the student to talk a little. <laughs> to the student for the student to talk a little, yes. Just a little, right? Not too much. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Right. Thank you guys. <laughs> what about the others? William, Jose Antonio, Carla Yanet, Isela, Carolina, Fatima. Fernando, Sandra, I'm saying all of your names. Miguel Angel, Ada, Miriam, Carla, Sabrina, Jocelyn. Oh my God, you're a lot. René and Roberto. It would be better. It would be better to let the, the students uh, to let the students speak more than the teacher. 
because they can learn. Uh, yeah. Rafael, would you prefer speak all the class or listen to us all the class? Hmm. Repeat that. Run would... that by listen, run that by me again. Run by run that by me again. Repetim, hello. <laughs> run that by me again, please. Run that by me again. Yeah, you said would you prefer? Uh-huh. Run that by me again means repeat. Yeah. <laughs> yes. It's another way of saying repeat, please. Uh-huh. Would you prefer speak all the class mm -hmm. or listen to us? Oh, you corrected yourself. Yeah. Okay. Would you prefer, and again, let's divide the verbs. Would you prefer to speak all the class? Let's use, come on, people in intermediate. Would you prefer to speak? the whole class repeat would, would you, you prefer to speak the whole class or listen to us would you rather oh good hey eh? that's a that's a topic we will see very soon would you rather uh-huh but right now let's stick to the plan let's stick to the plan would okay you, would you prefer to speak to the whole to speak the whole class or listen to us would you prefer to speak to the whole class or listen to us I prefer to listen to you from time to time. Okay, from time to time. 50 to 50. No, 80-20. Remember, 80-20. <laughs> from time to time, more often. Okay, more often. Every okay. now and then. Every good, every now and then. Most of all. Most of all. Overall, most of all. Okay, yeah, I I honestly prefer to listen to you guys, but if you don't want to speak, I mean, what can I do, right? What can I do? Give me suggestions. What could I do? Wouldn't it be better if Sabrina, Isa, Isela, I'm sorry. For example, for example, in my case, uh, it would be better to study more, more vocabulary for uh, to have the more complete conversation, long conversation. To have longer conversations and use comparatives. Yeah, I like that. To have longer conversations to get more vocabulary. Okay, what do you think, Carla, Ivania? Wouldn't it be better if you just listen to me? The whole class, two hours speaking. That'd be terrible. No? Am I boring? <laughs> come on, Sabrina. Apply the, the, the grammar. Everybody, come on. How would you like your class to be? Use the grammar. It will be better to speak, teacher. For well, students, for students to speak. Yes, uh, sometimes I don't understand some, um, I don't know what to say, temas. Some topics. Some topics, and that is the reason for I stay quiet. I stay quiet, yeah. Quiet. <laughs> I understand. I understand some words. Uh -huh. I don't know what to say. What to say? Very, very good, Sabrina. I love to hear you speaking, guys. And I love to, to hear you making mistakes. That's my job. Okay. That is my job. And don't be shy. Don't be afraid of making mistakes. Okay. Mistakes are part of the success. It's part of your learning process. Uh huh. It would be better. It would be better 
if we watch the, the videos, uh, the no, sorry, it would be better if we repeat the videos. Oh, if we re-watch re the class. Re -watch. Okay. Yeah, if we re-watch the class. Yeah. Yeah, that, that's a great idea. It will be better. It will be good. Not better. It will be good if... It will be good. Yeah. Okay. So I think you got it, guys. Do you have any questions? It will be better. What is the difference between it will be good and it will be better? Ada? Uh, no, Miguel. Okay, so, acuérdense, si yo digo, it will be, ¿qué estoy diciendo? Sería. Sería. Okay, better? Mejor. No es más mejor. Sería mejor. <laughs> okay, be careful. Okay, better. Mejor. Entonces, y good es solo bueno, ¿verdad? Sería bueno. Sería mejor. Okay. What about would you prefer? Mm. Can I say, can I say, wouldn't you prefer? Yes, that's the point. Wouldn't you prefer? Pero entonces nos saldríamos un poco de, de la gramática que estamos viendo, okay? So there are many ways in, you can use this. Let me just check really quick. The agenda, okay. Hmm. Okay, so now we have an exercise. I'm going to have two exercises with you. Okay, I'm going to split the class so you can work on exercise five on page 22. It's very simple. What you have to do is just organize the sentences here. Okay, do you prefer to have will a different schedule, be it to revise, wouldn't better manual before printing, okay? So just structure the sentences. I'm going to split you so you can discuss. Make sure you talk to each other. Don't just do it. Discuss. Hey, what do you think? Okay. Bien, y les voy a empezar a pedir a, a muchos, a la mayoría en realidad, que le ayuden a sus compañeros. Si alguno de sus compañeros tiene cara de pollito comprado y no quiere opinar, ayudémosle. ¿Cómo le vamos a ayudar? Preguntémosle. Hey, what do you think? Help us. I don't know the answer. It's difficult. So what do you think? What goes first? Hmm. Okay. Okay. Help each other. I want to see more teamwork in this class. Okay. Got it? Okay. Good. It. Let's do it. We're going to be in very small groups. Let's do it together. And by the way, that is page 22. Page 22. Let's go. Okay. Twenty page twenty page twenty one. Hello. Hello. Page twenty two. Twenty two. Ah, okay. Exercise 20. five. Twenty two. Sure five. Okay. Okay, girls, let's do it. Okay. Um, number two. Mm -hmm. um, wouldn't, wouldn't it be better? Wouldn't it be better to to revise to revise the manual the, the manual manu before printing before printing? Mm -hmm. Wouldn't it wouldn't mm -hmm. wouldn't it be better? Okay. Yeah. Next. Will it 
It will be good. Would it, it, would, it, would, it would it be good? Be good. Be good. Uh -huh. yes. Would it be good? good uh, if, if, if would it be good? Oh, uh, no. No, no, no. no. Would it be good? Would it? See, would it be good if um, that uh, if we change the dress code? If we change the dress code, mm -hmm. yes. Um, number four would be. Would we eat? Uh, Carla, it, wait me, please. It would be. Would be it would be? Carla. Yes, sorry. Wait me, please. Okay. okay. <laughs> or slow, please. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. <laughs> you are writing? No, give me a second, the number three, please. Ah, okay. Would it be good if we could change the dress code? That's right. Would it be good if we change for me? Yes. Okay. If... Would be it. Okay, good. Would be it. I don't. Okay. Would be it. Uh, would it be. Would, I haven't heard. It, I haven't heard Carla at all. Sorry? I haven't heard Carla. And Carla Ivani, I'm sorry. I haven't heard. I haven't heard Carla. Um, I say. <laughs> what do you think? What do you think, Carla? <laughs> hey, practice everybody, not just one or two, everybody. Hey, we, we would. <coughs> how, how we do that? Man. It will be, it will be it good. good. It would be good. Okay. If we, if we change the dress code, it would be good if we if if we we if we change the dress code. All right, and uh, number four, who's be who did it? Would be a good idea to have a training manual for shift. It would a good idea. It would be a good idea to have a good idea. Training manual for shift. Let me manual. Oh, one, one for chef, right? Yeah. yeah. And the last one. Uh, wouldn't it be better? Wouldn't it be better to let the manager decide. I'm not sure, but what do you think about the last one? Yeah, I it will, yeah, because it's question. And the number two, I have a duke. Uh, it no is perfect. A doubt. 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 No doubt. Doubt. The number two, it no is first. The subject. And not because no is question. It's not. It's not question. Oh, it's not a question. It's not a it's question. Not a question. 
It will be correct. It's correct. School will be. In the subject. What is you look up the subject after the the word to revise i don't know it's <clears throat> let me check the example yeah for example yeah, it, it would not be better to let the manager <laughs> of the question it it subject subject is first well, in this case i guess that is uh, wouldn't it be better yeah because because it's a question yes you, but you, in, this, you have, in this case no it's question you have a question mark okay. at the end i don't know <laughs> yeah in this case you have a question mark wouldn't it be better uh, yeah 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 i don't see yes. okay. i'm sorry no no problem man and the last one i'm not yeah. sure yeah, we had because to, you, you uh, used to let the manager be decide. Yeah, it's correct. Would it be would better, it be better to, let to let the manager decide? decide. Yeah. yeah, for yeah. me it's correct. Okay, yeah. this one, the number four, is not a question. Check yeah. at the yeah. end, it's not a question mark, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. In this case, uh, how can we rewrite it? Okay. Yeah. Good. This one, number four, it's right. Yes. Oh, yeah. 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 It's all right. All right. No, it's not. It's it's have, it would be a good oh. idea to have a. Yeah, I found a mistake. Have a training manual. Training manual. Training manual. Manual. Yeah. For chief. Chief or chair? Bye. Uh, bye. Is good and good and be better. Wouldn't it be better to let the manager? Okay. To let the manager. Oh. The manager be better and the word decide. No, no, ah, uh, no, no, no. Wouldn't it be better? Ah, uh, it, it, question uh -huh. mark. Question. Yes, uh -huh. question. Mm -hmm. Okay, wouldn't person wouldn't. Wouldn't it, it, wouldn't it be better uh -huh. to let the manager and the last word decide? Yes. Wouldn't it be better? So, uh, I'm gonna start the second one and the next, the third, and second. Couldn't it? Wouldn't it be better to revise the manual before printing? Yes. Okay. Yes. That's right. Rina, welcome. Hello, welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Um, what sentence are they solving? Uh, we have, for example, the which one do you have? We comp we complete the all sentence and questions. Hold it. We completed. Uh, uh, we completed. 
we completed all the sentences. All the sentences. You're done? Are you done? Yes. Yes? Okay. <laughs> Let's check the answers. Let's go back. Okay. Okay, let's go. Let's see your answers. This was meant to be easy. So help me, who's got number two? It's a question, a question. Alexander, it's a question? Yeah. Yes. Okay, what's the question, guys? Wouldn't it be better to revise the manual before printing? Arian, Loto. That's it? Yeah, because the question mark is at the end. Yep. Wouldn't it be better to revise the manual before printing? Okay, thank you. Let me see. Jose or Miguel Angel. Miguel Angel, let's go with number three. Yeah. Um, it will be good if we change the dress code. Okay. It will be good if we change the dress code. Everybody agrees? Changed. Okay. Changed. Hmm. Hmm. Mm. Following the structure <laughs> above. It would be good if we change. Ah. Hmm. Hmm. I have my doubts as well, but. Mm -hmm. This is a conditional. Yeah. Would be good if we changed the dress code. Mm. Okay. Mm. Next, number four, Sandra Elizabeth. It's cool. Be a good idea to have. A training manual for chef. Okay. Yeah, it will be a good idea if, to have a training manual for chefs. Do we all agree? Do we all agree? Yes, teacher. Yes. 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 Okay. Yes. Where is, where is Jose? I think Jose got disconnected, right? Can find Jose. Jose Antonio. Jose Antonio. Number five. 
Jose Antonio, number five. <laughs> okay, Jose Antonio, go with number five. Okay. Order. Order. Mm -hmm. Order. 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 Mm -hmm. Wouldn't it be better? Mm -hmm. Be better. To 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 let let manager manager let manager. Come on, Jose Antonio. Manager. Let the manager. Uh huh. Decide. Jose Antonio, come on, decide. To let the manager decide. 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 Okay, decide. 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 Okay, wouldn't it be decide. better to let the manager decide. decide? Decide. Okay, let's continue practicing. Let me just open something here really quick. No. Oh, but this is me. Where is the other one? Here. There it is. Okay, now I got to make this bigger. I'll try to work with this. Hopefully it works. Okay. <laughs> Okay, let me know if you can see. Okay, can you see? Bigger. Yeah. You want you want to see it bigger? Okay, hold on. Let me leave this here and I need to leave this there. Oh, okay. Is that better? Ok, lo único yeah. que ven en su pantalla es esto, ¿verdad? Yeah. Yes. Ok, solo esto ven, no ven nada más, right? Mm, no, solo eso. Ok, ready? So, yeah. ok. <laughs> Let's see. Wouldn't it be nice if we were... What do you think? Tourist. <laughs> okay, how do we do this? Let's go to the chat. Go open your chat, please. Your Zoom chat. Okay, ready? Open, open your Zoom chat. I'm going to go part by part. Type your answer, what you hear, the missing word, type it on the chat. Wouldn't it be nice if we were older? That, who's got the answer? Go to the chat. Do you have the answer? Wouldn't it be nice if we were older? We need to write just older. Okay. If yeah, that's that's it. The missing words. Okay. Someone on the chat, oh, on the chat here in Zoom. There you go, older. Thank you, Jocelyn. Then we wouldn't have to wait so long. Then we wouldn't have to wait so long. Write the missing word. Then we wouldn't have to wait so long. Wait, very good, William. Okay. 
And wouldn't it be nice to live together? Wouldn't it be nice to live together? Yeah. Together. <laughs> you got it. In the kind of world where we belong. War. In the kind of world where we belong. Excellent. World. World. Okay. You know, it's going to make it that much better. You know, it's going to make it that much better. Good. When we, when we can say good night and stay together. Good night. Easy. Okay. Now, select the right option. I want you to take a tool. Everybody, take a tool from your Zoom, a sticker or the pen. Take a stamp if you want. And you're just going to select the right answer okay whether it's make or wake up so wouldn't it be nice if we could wake up wake up wake, wake up <clears throat> okay wake up okay wake up okay say it it's perfect say it okay in the morning when the day is new 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 ada what do you think New? Okay. New. Hey, lo quiero escuchar a todos. Come on. New. New. And after having spent the, the day together? Spent. 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 Okay. Good. Very good. Okay. Hmm. Hold each other close the whole night through. Spent. Okay. okay. The whole night, night through. Night. 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 night through. Very good. Night. night through. Happy times together. Okay. We've been spending. 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 Okay. spending. I wish that every kiss was never ending. Never. 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 Okay. Yeah. Wouldn't it be nice? Next, Spanish. say the word. What is missing? Maybe, sorry, maybe, maybe if we think and wish. Sing and, and wish. Okay. Hope and pray it might come true. Hope and pray. Pray. Hope and pray. Pray, right? Okay. Pray it might come true. Come true. <laughs> Baby, then there wouldn't be a single thing we couldn't do. A single thing. Single thing. A single thing. Single thing. A single thing we couldn't do. We could be married. We could be better. And we could be happy. And we could be happy. Happy, okay. Will it, wouldn't it be nice? Okay, you got it, right? Oh, now let's cross out. Erase the, 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 the extra word. There's one more word here. We don't, we don't need that extra word, okay? You know, it seems the more we talk about it. What is the extra? Chicos, eh, podríamos enfocarnos en la clase, porfa. Thank you. Y si pueden encender la cámara, se los puede agradecer. Thank you. You know, it seems the more we talk about it, what is more here? What we don't need on that sentence. You know, it seems it, the more we talk about it. It, it seems. De, de. Mm, listen. Yes. De. You know, it mm. seems mm. the more we talk about it. That. 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 Yeah, you don't need that. that. You know, it seems the more we talk about it, it only makes it worse to live without it. It makes it worse to live without it. It only makes it, I'm sorry, it only makes it worse to live without it. 
it only makes it worse to live without no, it. Then, 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 then. Excellent, yes. Then. But, but let's talk about it. But let's talk about it. No. no. Now, no. perfect. No. Yeah. Wouldn't it be nice? Really? 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 Okay. <laughs> you got it, okay. Hey, come on, you see? Listening is very important as well. Okay, let's go with another part of this exercise. Get your hand, um, a notebook, please. Get a notebook. Get a notebook and a pen. Before yeah. I go, before I go with the next exercise, hold on. Ada Susana Cáceres Mendoza. Present, teacher. Thank you, Alexander de Jesús Sánchez Soto. Present. Carla Ivania Cabrera Serrano. <sighs> Carla Ivania. Yes. Thank you. Carlos Armando Duarte. Claudia Maricela Solano Crespin. Present teacher. Elvin Arcides y Isabel Martinez. Fátima y Fegenia López Ramos. Present. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Isela Liliana Miranda Espinosa. Present. José Antonio Cubías Hernández. Present. Carla Yanet Amaya Herrera. Present, teacher. Okay. Miguel Ángel Paz Landa Verde. Present. Miriam Carolina Mozo Valdés. René Alfonso Madrid Escalante. Present. Rina Marisabel Álvarez de Chávez. Present. Roberto Luis Umaña Orellana. Okay. Sabrina Mabel Latín Castro. Present teacher. Okay. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present. William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Present. Eh, por cierto, perdón, paréntesis, no me equivoco. Sí, William, nos toca estar hoy 10 minutos después de la clase, ¿ok? Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Alan Christopher Abrego Brizuela. Present. Carolina Ivette Romero Avelino. I'm here. Okay. Johnny Vladimir Portillo Chávez. Present teacher. José Alfredo Sandoval Sarabia. José Ángel Martínez Hernández. Juan Marcos Guzmán. Juan is not here again. Okay. Okay. Let's move on. Let's continue. Ready? Pen and paper. Pen and paper. Let me just do this to the side. And so we have two sentences that you need to translate into English.
Yo supongo que algún vecino ha de tener esa bulla, ¿verdad? Ya. Yeah. <laughs> I was thinking that some. <laughs> ok. De hecho, hay un, hay un cumpleaños, había el otro lado en el ran, rancho del padrino. Oh. They don't invite us. They didn't invite us, yeah. Ok. No cheating. Don't go to Google Translate. If you're trying to go to Google Translate, you will be cheating yourself. Hope you understood. Si no lo entendieron, no se vayan a Google Translate. Eso es trampa y solo ustedes mismos se dirían trampa. Si necesitas traducir una palabra, solo una palabra, no, no toda la oración. Ready? No. Yes, yes. How else can you say aún no? No yet. No yet. Ready? Yes. Okay, let's do it. How do we do this? I need to make sure you guys are understanding. So let me try with Claudia Maricela first. Please go with the first sentence. Claudia Maricela. 
Yes, I'm here, teacher. Um, now, uh, I'm going to be honest with you. Now, I'm working only. I hear the class. Sorry. They're just listening to the class, okay? Well, hearing the class, okay? I understand. Okay, Carolina Yvette. How will you do the first? Mm -hmm. first. Mm -hmm. um, that, sorry, I'm as appropriate of curricula in privado. Uh, it could it couldn't be better to correct in pride in pray bite. Gooden, gooden. Mm. Good end, good end. Wouldn't and good end. To correct. Uh-huh. To correct. Private. In private. I'm private. In private. What do you think, guys? Can you help me? What are we missing or what we need to correct here? Uh, wouldn't it be better to correct oh. here in private? Wouldn't it be better uh, to correct here? Oh, wouldn't be. To correct her it's in her. private. Yes. Private. Wouldn't it be better to correct her? Interrogation. Oh. Interrogation. It could be, it could be, I'm sorry. Someone was making a question. Question mark. Yes. Okay. Wouldn't it be better to correct her in private? Very good. Uh, number two, Rene. Oh, okay, teacher. Uh, well, no, no. It will, uh, it will be better accept the. Sorry, it will be better. They say they say they say ganar. How do you say ganar? Uh, uh -huh. Earn. Okay. Air. Uh, air. Uh, accept air, the minimum. The minimum. Minimum. Time to sell. Minimum. Uh -huh. The minimum, the minimum time to sell interview. Yeah. The minimum time to sell minimum. Time mm -hmm. to sell interview. Are you saying sell? Sell sell interview. Your during charity. Yeah. Okay. Help me guys. Um in this case, I believe, in my opinion, it would be more acceptable mm -hmm. to earn win, to the win. minimum before selling your integrity. No. Oh, no. Yeah, we we, be more we can minimum, we specify? Yeah. Can we specify the the minimum the minimum salary uh, pay? Yeah. Uh -huh. salary ah minimum wage yeah. than selling selling your thank you selling yeah. but sounds better selling right selling selling. selling whose integrity your integrity your integrity your. because in the yeah. sentence you are telling integrity. to someone integrity yeah. yes yes it will be more will acceptable be more. to earn this minimum wage mm -hmm. than selling wage. your integrity. Perfect. Wage. Okay. Okay. Uh, bien, si ya participaron, ya le agarraron la onda, sienten que ya lo entienden, dejen que alguien oh. más lo, lo haga, sí. please, todos. Si, si, necesito escuchar a varios. Uh, Just let me see. Um, Rina Álvarez. Let's go with Rina. Uh -huh. ¿No estarías mejor trabajando okay. en la embajada? Italiano. <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't be better better yeah. of working okay. at the embassy uh but, sorry one more time you were would, you would, 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 you yeah. wouldn't uh -huh. be better uh -huh. working in no, at the embassy. Oh, in the embassy. It's okay, at the embassy. 
Okay, uh, okay, yeah. it's a question. Who can help me? Question. Uh, let, let me choose Sandra okay. Elizabeth. Can you correct the sentence, Sandra? Uh, will you? No, uh, sorry. Uh, will, will you be better of working? Of working at the embassy. Okay, Jose Antonio, what do you think? It's good. Wooden. Aha, uh -huh. wooden. Wooden, wooden. It. it? Okay. Be better? It. It will be better. Mm, let's see, Ada Susana, what do you think? It's good, be better, and work in there. Uh, hmm. Let me see, Fernando, what do you think? Uh, wouldn't it be better working at the embassy? Uh, hmm, 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 hmm. To working. Mm, mm, mm. Miguel Angel? Working. Wouldn't it be better to work? At the embassy? Close. Wouldn't you be better? Okay, guys. Uh, okay. Carla Janet, what do you think? Who work? Working. Uh, wouldn't, be better work. wouldn't it be better work? Okay. At One last end? chance. One last chance. Fatima. <laughs> wouldn't be better to work in the embassy? Okay. Mm -mm. Wouldn't you be better? No estarías tú. No estarías mejor trabajando en la embajada. Bien, analicemos eso. Wouldn't you be better working at the embassy? ¿Por qué? A ver, ¿a ¿qué verbo está afectando eh, would en esta oración? Quiero que los que les consulté me contesten ahorita. ¿eh? Lo que fui elegiendo. Be. A verb to be. A verb to be. Ok, no estarías. Wouldn't you be? Ajá, estarías. Correcto. Be. Better. Y trabajando está en qué? En Gerund, right? Yeah, so wouldn't you be better working in the U.S. Embassy, in the, in the embassy, right? In the, at the embassy, sorry. Wouldn't you be better working at the embassy? Ok. That's good. Carla Janet, go with the next sentence. Sería mejor ganar en libras británicas que en dólares. It would, it would be, it would be better air. Uh, we can expound than dollars. <laughs> Okay, same. Rina, help me. <clears throat> no. It would, it would be better to earn. Excellent. To earn. To earn. I need the preposition. Yes, to earn. Britannic pounds and dollars. Alan, what do you think? It will be better to earn British pound than US dollar. Okay, it will be better to earn British pounds than dollars. You got it. That's right. Very good. And the last one, Johnny. Eso demostraría tu capacidad de negociar. Mm, that would show your capacity of business. What's the business? You're good. You're good. Up to this point, you're good, Johnny. That will show your capacity. How do you say negotiate in English? Negotiate. 
Negotiate. Mm. Oh, negotiate. Negotiate. Your capacity of negotiating. Mm. Oh, if God. I say dealing or dealing? dealing, your dealing capacity, your capacity of dealing something else. Your, Come on. Your ability. Your capacity, your no capacity is capacity. Uh -huh. So far, so good, but we're missing the word negotiar. How do you say negotiar in other words? Yeah. Negotiate, deal, treat, yeah. treat. Uh, Google it to negotiate. That will show your bargain capacity. Let me see. I will show your bargain capacity. Okay. Yeah, I will show your bargain capacity. Okay. Bargain to bargain. 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 Do you bargain when you go to the supermarket, to the local market, I'm sorry? Do you bargain with the sellers, the vendors, when you go to the supermarket? In the market, yeah. <laughs> okay, it's on, that's on your chat. Please review and understand why does that happen. Okay, give me one second. Now let's continue. You have to get it and get it right. I'm going to show you some examples of problems that I have. Health problems, problems. You have to use, well, it better. Let me give you an example. Um, so the, this is the first situation. A patient, a doctor, doctor, I'm feeling sick. I don't want to get worse. What can I do? Okay. What will the patient say? I'm sorry, the doctor say, doctor, I'm feeling sick. I don't want to get worse. 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 I'm sorry, I don't want to get worse. What can I do? Wouldn't it be better if you make an appointment and we check you? Okay. Wouldn't it be better if we checked you off to see we'll what's going on? Okay, good. Wouldn't it be better if you rest during the weekend? Okay. Next situation, um, Miguel, Angel, let's try. Jonathan, um, Miguel, Miguel Angel, I have a fever. Tell me what to do. Um, you have to take a set of Okay, <laughs> now let's use, will it be better or it will be better if? Okay, uh, would you be better take acetaminophen? Again? Would you be better to take acetaminophen? Okay, it will be better if, repeat. It will be better if? You took acetaminophen. You took a okay. It would okay. be better uh, visit the doctor. It will be better to visit, visit the doctor. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's right. It would be better to visit the doctor. It will be better to take a pill. It will be better to take a pill. Okay. For the fever. Next. Mom, mom, Bill is bleeding. What should I do? What, what is bleeding? Bleeding, blood. You cut your hand with a knife, your finger it would, with... Okay. It would okay. be better to, to call an, an ambulance. An ambulance. Ambulance. Very good. Ambulance. It would be better to call an ambulance. It would be better. Uh-huh. Carla, Fatima. Okay, Bill is bleeding. What... What it could we will do? be better uh, 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 take a bandage. Take a bandage, put a bandage. Yeah, put a bandage. Okay. 
would be better to put a bandage to stop the bleeding, to stop the bleeding. Okay. Carla, Fatima, my arm hurts a lot. I think I might have a fracture. My arm hurts a lot. I think I might have a fracture. You're the doctor, Carla, Fatima. Jose Antonio, Rene, Carla, Vania. Sabrina, come on, William. Um, it would be better better to check your arm. To check your arm, yes. How do you say rayos X in rayos X is in English? X three. <laughs> so, uh huh. Carolina. I think my. I think I might have a fracture on my arm, Carolina. It hurts a lot. It could be better to go to the hospital. Okay, and have some x-rays. Okay, it would be better to have some x-rays. It would be better to go to the hospital. Okay, two more. Honey, my, my, my oh, go ahead. It would be better if you don't do exercise. Will be better if you don't do exercise. Perfect. Uh, William, my migraine is back. Eso está incorrecto. Has back, has come back. Yeah. My mm -hmm. migraine has come back. William, what do I do? Uh, it will be better if you take a nap, maybe. Really? Take a nap. Yeah. I follow your advice. Uh, what do you think, Ada? What will be better? for me to do if I have a migraine. It will be better to take a nap. Take a nap. You know, that doesn't work for me. What works for me um, is to get into the, the bathtub with ice, a cold shower, a very cold shower is the only thing that kills my migraines. Okay. <laughs> okay. And the last one. Please help me, doctor. My girlfriend has an extreme diarrhea and she is not happy about it. I think that was too much. I'm sorry. I didn't read this before. Okay. My girlfriend is sick and she is not happy about it. It will be better. Visit the doctor. Take the exams. <laughs> Take some exams, COVID, oh my God, okay. Drink the, drink the water and the sweat oral, no sé cómo se dice. <laughs> mm, hey, how do you say sweat in English, guys? <laughs> I don't know everything. How do you say sweat? Sweat? I, I, I heard sweat. Yeah, serum, 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 okay. Serum. It's not oral, it's just serum. Okay. Okay, so good. I hope you got the point. This is very important. Practice, do more exercises. Si aún se sienten perdido con este topic, please do more exercises. Okay, now in pairs, you have to exchange the index you created in the previous page with a classmate and give suggestions about how to improve it isn't would be better or alternative ex expressions. Do you remember the index you set up? How um, it was better to, to organize a table in the proper way? Okay, you remember the index you made yesterday? Yes. Right, yes. so... Okay, let's talk about that training manual. What will be better? So you need to give suggestions to your classmate. It's just a conversation. So if you're training your employees, it will be better to start with the company policies, you know, get them, get them to know your company better. I mean, it's the first time you have this employee. So in my opinion, it will be better to introduce the, comp the company to the employee. So let's start the training talking about the schedule policies, talking about the 
schedule changes policies. How does it work? Okay. And again, it's just about having a conversation. Y eso es importante, les he dicho, ser muy creativos, meterse en el rol, tú eres el entrenador, todos son entrenadores ahorita y tienen que hablar sobre la disposición de el, del itinerario que van a seguir en el entrenamiento. ¿Qué es lo mejor primero? Introducir la empresa al empleado o hablar de los procesos que llevará a cabo el empleado, las responsabilidades que desarrollará, cómo las va a ejecutar. What's better? Y dentro de eso, ¿qué va primero? ¿Qué va después? So it's just about having a discussion, talk. Talk, talk. Y para hacerlos hablar, vamos a hacer algo. Okay. So, please make sure you speak. How many are we? We are 22. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Miriam, please accept the invitation because Fatima is alone. Let's go. Good job. I too. Okay. To a ceremony. Okay. What would be better? Yeah. Okay. It will be better if the employees uh, now knows the training rules, for example. Training, training. It will be better if the employees know, uh, yeah, knows the training rules. Training rules. Mm -hmm. Yeah, or it will be better. If the company uh, got a manual to each employee, employees, employees, when it's in, teacher, uh, when it's singular, is employee or employee? The correct employee. Employee. Yeah. Okay. Now, if you say employees, employees. Um, that's plural, right? So you you yeah. you treat it as you don't treat it as third person. Be careful with the third persons. Remember, get to know, get to know. If the employees get to know, go ahead. The employees get to know the training rules. It will be better if the employees get to know the training rules. Okay. Um, what else? I don't know. Okay. Por eso que ayer de, de, de restaurante yo no sabía. <laughs> yeah, but in that, in that mundo in muy the, aparte. In the same way, but you know, you uh, before you get, keep in touch with your patient, you must be in some protocol, right? It's the same with the restaurant. You made uh, some changes like, uh, hey, the, you are training in the training course and you are going to, okay, I'm going to show you how you sit in the table or you are, how can you um, uh, requ request in uh, uh, chief change or something like that, okay? I'm we are going to, uh, Rearrange the index, okay? I need okay. you to help me. What are we gonna do first? In my case, I think the, the first thing I do is like uh, I'm going to train the people that will want to work with me, okay? And okay. what we what other tell me? What would you like to show him before they keep? Get touch with the customer. Uh, 
Uh, I know, I know, I know no um, relation the customer, only the employees, the nurse. Okay. The... I'm new. I'm new. I'm going. I'm going to. Uh, I'm a. How can I say? Uh, intern. Okay. I'm an, I'm an intern, and I'm going to uh, start with uh, introduce the surgery protocols. What you are going to show me how? What the first thing you're going to do? Protocol. The surgery. Yes, I'm. I'm. Uh, I. I I'm protocol. I no. No protocol is norms. Norms. Okay. No, I am arrived the hospital. I am a um, sanitation protocol. I okay. am. A... And, okay, I'm. I'm going to uh, instead of I am try to use them. Yes. Okay. Yes. I am. Okay. I arrived the hospital and then a sanitation the protocol. Yes, uh, yes. Here uh, are arrived the round the hospital. This yeah, around, around the uh -huh. hospital. Okay. And the hospital then uh, um, examination and. Pero podemos agregar de los que no hayan estado ahí, verdad? Yeah, yeah. For ah, example. Oh, okay. Uh, just to ask, for example, when, hi, Renan, how are you? Okay, um, uh, we practice the presentation now, okay? okay. We have dress count, punctual, and you can continue, okay? How, okay, uh -huh. um, hi, Renan, how are you? Hi, Claudia, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, uh, Renee. Um, now, I needed to gain me some advance because tomorrow I start for a new job in a restaurant. And what do you think? Uh, it's You will be a better, a uh, good presentation for dress code. What do you think? Oh. Um, okay. Okay. Mm. But in the which is the in the group, which is the number five? Number um, let me see. Was number five was addressing kitchen kitchen personal. Uh, we addressing kitchen personal. I don't remember. Mm. Ok. Bien, en siete años he descubierto una gran brecha entre adultos y jóvenes. ¿Saben cuál es la brecha? Eh, que entre mayor estás, es más difícil para ti ser de mente abierta. Son raras las personas y son mis personas favoritas, los adultos que piensan como alguien de 25 o 30 años en relación a su vida, es decir, actúan felices todo el tiempo, fuera de lo común ver a alguien así, ¿no? Entre más maduras, más cerrado te vuelves, esa es mi teoría, lo que he visto, lo que he experimentado. ¿En qué me afecta esto, teacher, y por qué me está diciendo esto? More boring. 
No, 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 no es eso, es solo que inconscientemente a este punto, a estas alturas del partido, lo que me han dicho a mí desde chiquito ya me caló. Imagínate cuánto tomó, en mi caso 39 años. Hay cosas que yo las doy por sentado y son así, pues, y nadie me saca de ahí, y eso se llama un paradigma. Eso es un paradigma. ¿Y quién te saca de ahí? Aprender otro idioma puede ser un poco complejo porque no quieres dar lugar a otras ideas. Tal vez un tema que estamos viendo. Ay, qué aburrido. Ay, hablar de restaurantes, eso no me sirve a mí. Mm, hey, pero el punto es hablar. Ok. Eh, y la principal brecha es que, bueno, los jóvenes no, los jóvenes se tiran y ya. Ah. O sea, incluso se ríen de sí mismos. Aprende a reírte de ti mismo. Si estás en un environment, un ambiente, un ambiente en el que estás aprendiendo, todos estamos aprendiendo aquí. Es normal. ¿Y sabes algo que me llama la atención de los bichos? Que me dicen las cosas y no, hombre, miren, yo no lo entiendo. Me perdí de plano. ¿Qué es lo que vamos a hacer? ¿Sí? Y de un solo, vea. Ya te agarran esa conversa. Agárrenme confianza, por favor. No les voy a regañar con que me hablen en español si están perdidos. No hay ningún problema. Es preferible que me lo digas. Antes que estar con tu compañero allá, vea. ¿Tú entendiste qué vamos a hacer? No, no sé. De repente llega el teacher y ¡Ay, sol! <risa> no pasa nada, chicos. No pasa nada. No tengan pena. ¿Sí? Botemos ese, ese paradigma. ¿Sí? Ese es el peor paradigma que puedes tener. Soy una persona que te está tratando de enseñar otro idioma, pero eso no quiere decir que yo tenga autoridad sobre ti y que te vaya a regañar en la clase. No, 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 los tiempos ya cambiaron. Tú eres el que haces esta clase, ¿ok? Bien, so, eso es lo que estábamos haciendo. A ver, eh, Johnny, seguime la corriente, Johnny, en español, ¿ok? Ah, y eso es lo que les iba a decir. Mi manera, la mejor manera que he aprendido yo de abordar un adulto es pintando los ejemplos en español primero, en cuanto a la gramática, ¿sí? Primero lo aterrizamos en español. ¿Por qué? Porque te, a un adulto en un nivel básico yo le digo, uh, dígame una oración en presente simple. Se lo digo en inglés, empieza a hablarme en pasado o en futuro. Entonces, ubicámonos primero en nuestro idioma. Ok, Johnny, um, ¿qué te ha parecido el, el manual de entrenamiento de los meseros? Yo, yo pensé, pienso que lo mejor sería empezar por, por la prevención de accidentes y seguridad. ¿Qué crees? Mm, ya, yeah, teacher. No, este no soy el teacher, be... soy Rafael, ahí el entrenador. Ajá. Uh, it would be better if we start en español, Johnny. En español, Johnny. Uh, y muy bien que estás aplicando yo... eso. Ajá. ¿Seguí aplicando eso pero en español, Johnny? No sería mejor. Ajá, ajá, muy bien, no sería mejor Ajá O sea, conocer Cómo está estructurado La ubicación Para prevenir cualquier error que cometamos Ah, muy bien, enseñarles primero en cuanto a Dónde está ubicada cada cosa dentro del restaurante las instalaciones, las normas y políticas del... Sí, ¿verdad? Mejor empezamos por eso. Sí, porque yo pensaba que el servicio al cliente es como la prioridad, ¿verdad? ¿Qué te parece si hablamos también de dentro de eso, del dress code, de la, la apariencia del, del mesero? Y entonces estás en una discusión. ¿No crees que sería mejor? ¿Don't you think? ¿O oh, no? ¿No crees que sería mejor? ¿Don't you think that it would be better? That it would be better to start talking about the dress code. ¿Sí? Y ahí vas. Entonces, ubiquémonos en el tema. Es una discusión entre dos personas sobre cómo hacer mejor las cosas en el orden de un índice de contenido de un manual de entrenamiento. Eso es ese recuadro. Es un índice de contenido de un manual de entrenamiento. Procesos que se deben de seguir dentro del entrenamiento, no con el empleado. Sí. So, vamos a hacerlo una vez más. Si no notaron, solo son dos. ¿Por qué solo nos puso de dos en dos? Dice, ah, porque necesito que sientas pena. Así. Y para que no digas, uy, quedémonos callados, vos le vas a decir al otro. No. Ahí sí vas a sentir, y si uno de los dos quiere hablar, ah, espero yo que así sea. So, let's do it one more time, just for 10 minutes. Talk. You have to speak. Ok. 
Let's reassign your classmates and let's do it together. Let's go. Hi. Hello, guys. Jocelyn, please go to the room. I send you another invitation, please, because Miguel is alone. Oh. <laughs> Come on, let me Jocelyn here. No, 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 no. No, yeah. you're, you two, you two are fine. You two are fine, but I need uh, Jocelyn with Miguel. I, I like to, to work with Jocelyn and Sabrina. I know. To make everything detailed perfectly. Please. Okay. Thank you. Send me an invitation, please, and I will accept it. Oh, again? Hold on. Yes, I didn't see it. You didn't get it? Ah, let me try to change the group. Okay. Good. Let me try to change the group first. One second. Teacher, I have a question. Mm -hmm. Pero no es con la clase. Eh, le, respecto a la primera semana de agosto, vamos a tener clase. No. no. Sí, vamos a descansar. Ok. Maybe. Yes, no. I know. Don't worry. Don't worry. No, but the the teacher wants to stay with me. Yeah, maybe. No, no, no. It's okay. Continue. <laughs> continue. Continue. Talk. I want to hear you. Okay. Let's see. Um... <laughs> no, es que sí te envié invitación, pero me apareces en los dos grupos aquí y en el 10. Oh my God. It's okay. And ya, wow. no te puedo, ya no te puedo mover. Entonces moví mejor a Miguel a otro grupo. Y ahí está ya tranquilo. Es que hay un compañero que pues, no puede estar con la cámara encendida porque anda manejando. Mm. So, let's continue. Okay. Okay. Guys, so okay. So, what are going we do? Can you help me, guys? Of course. I understand one. about the rules, you know, but I don't understand about the topic. Um, uh, for, for example, about the topic yesterday, index, I don't understand. Okay, but um, what can we do? You can arrange the, the you understand the rules, right? Okay. Yes, I understand. Did we start the conversation with Sabrina? Explain her what what is it? What is the index about? In this is, uh, for example, about procedures. I don't know. Yeah, the the list. Okay, what you have in that chart is a list of topics. Okay, you have to train Jocelyn and Alan. They are waiters. They're going to work as waiters at your restaurant and you have to train them. So what do you say first? What do you teach them first? ¿Qué le vas a enseñar primero a ellos? Dress code? Mm, how to address a customer? ¿Cómo dirigirte a los clientes? How to address the kitchen personnel? Could you order? Okay. So what goes first? Or are you going to talk about schedules first? You, you are the trainer. So what is more important in that index? No. Um, mm, por ejemplo, <laughs> ser puntual. Okay. <laughs> Being uh, punctual. What is that, guys? She wants to tell us about the schedule that we need to follow. Schedule. So look at the chart, Sandra. You have 
schedule adherence or something like that. Hey, I said adherence. <laughs> adherence. So that's following the schedule. Yes, that's the first point. Okay. So you think following the schedule should be first. Okay. Okay, perfect. Keep going. Ah, o sea, vos me estás contando que está como que está nerviosa, ¿verdad? Eh, y the opening, the nervous, the opening of the restaurant. Y entro yo ahí. I think I'll show eh, the fears eh, the the staff dress code, ah, dress code, and after all uh, time, ah, 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 eso, eso es, and hmm, para la sugerencia será dress code, ah, en ah, podría decirte, no sé, que ah, qué hacemos. Uniforme, el dress code, formal, uh -huh. algo formal, sí. vestimenta formal. El dress code to prepare the staff, para preparar el personal. To prepare the staff, para, ajá. Uh -huh. uh, ahorita de meternos en el rol de que los dos son entrenadores. ¿verdad? Tienen un entrenamiento okay. la próxima semana. Uh -huh. Vienen 30 meseros, el restaurante es enorme. Ok, o son va una cadena de restaurantes y van para diferentes restaurantes, los 10 por restaurante, no sé. Entonces, en ese uh -huh. contexto, tienen que discutir entre los dos. Mira, ¿qué, qué, ¿qué vas a dar tú? Vamos a dividir 15 y 15. ¿Qué vas a dar tú primero en el entrenamiento? Ah, eh, uh -huh. Creo que sería, sería mejor empezar por sí. el dress code y tú. Um, yo creo que uh -huh. sería mejor por los horarios, the schedule, following the schedules. Para que la gente, los que uh -huh. no quieran, los quieran los horarios, mejor que se vayan. Vea, ajá. Ah, sí, sí, sí. Yeah. Following the schedules. Okay. And changing. So I can say about the changing of schedules, right? Requesting a yeah. schedule change. Okay. ¿Y ahí vas? Okay. Sí, ajá. sí, porque vamos a empezar como desde que estábamos preocupados y qué íbamos a hacer. Por ahí vamos a empezar. Mm -hmm. Okay. Bye, Claude. Ah, it was cold and... Pero ahí tendríamos que cambiar entonces. Ah, ya. Yeah. Yeah. yeah but you want. <laughs> yeah. Um, but this is the first. Hey. We told... And what about addressing customers? Uh, on, I, okay. In this case, we didn't. Yeah, because you learn about your business first, and then you apply to the customer and uh, your knowledge. Mm -hmm. The first one is following the schedule, then requesting a shift change, dress code. Yeah, dress code. Addressing kitchen personnel. And the next one can be getting to know the menu. Getting to know the menu. He trained me. Uh, he, 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 oh. he told me, yeah. he told me that if he trained me. That it we, would be better if uh, first train me on how to dress in the client, for example. I don't know it's correct. No, how to, como se dice, locate it. Como era? Grading. Uh -huh. Greeting. Greeting. Mm -hmm. How to greet oh, okay. the customers. How, how to greet the, greet the customer. What, uh, in, in what context is correct to use client and, or customers? What is the difference? Um, there is no difference in general. Terms one is a client, uh, one is a customer. It's, it's more common to speak with with the word customer. I, I in, general, in general terms, a customer is someone that has been 
for many years with the company. Un customer uh -huh. que lleva años con la compañía. Un cliente es alguien que, que puede, puede hasta caso. ser un cliente potencial. Ah, si okay. quiera que le haya vendido. Yeah. Y en el negocio de los call centers, el cliente es el que da el trabajo y el customer es el al que vos atendés. De nuevo, okay. es el que te da el trabajo al call center y al customer es el que tú atendes en las llamadas. Separate things. Um, ok, so, estos chicos es de discutir. Los tres son entrenadores. Y mira vos, ¿qué crees que va primero? Ah, pues, yo creo que voy a empezar a hablar del dress code, porque los 15 que traemos de vencero, ¿qué facha la que traen? Yo creo que es de donde It would be better to, to start with, with the dress code training, because... Because they, uh, appear, the, they are because, all kids. Because the, 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 the employees uh, always uh, dressing bad for are always the employees are always dressing bad. Are always dressing bad. Okay. Mm -hmm. What do you think, uh, Miguel or Aurelia? Think. No, think. 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 I think that the first uh, the first thing that I I have to do uh, it would be better <gasps> if uh -oh. I attendance. Look at the time. Let's go. Right. Sorry, I'm just waiting for the rest. René se quedó solo y no regresa. He's doing something. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Pues sí, y fíjense que René me dijo que. Pues René. Estoy entrando. Okay, guys. Good. Hey, Rene, uh, do you work at a gym or something? Hi, teacher. Sorry. You work at a gym or something? Uh, uh, no, teacher. Only uh, uh, coach the badminton. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're a badminton uh -huh. coach. For, for badminton. Yeah, uh -huh. I know badminton. We have a badminton federation. Yes. Oh. <laughs> awesome. That's good. Okay, guys, let's go. I'm going to stick with, with William Alexander tonight. Okay, let's go. Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. Present. Good night. Carla Ivania Cabrera Serrano. Present. Ada Susena Cáceres Present. Mendoza. <laughs> Carlos Armando Duarte. Claudia Maricela Solano Crespín. Present teacher, good night. Good night, Elvin Arcides Eguizabal Martínez. Fátima y Fegenia López Ramos. Fernando Present. Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Thank you. Isela Liliana Miranda Espinosa. Present, good night. Good night, José Antonio Cubías Hernández. Present teacher. Carla Yanet, Amaya Herrera. Present teacher. Miguel Ángel Paz, Landa Verde. Present, see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow, Miriam Carolina Mozo Valdés. Present. Thank you, René Alfonso Madrid Escalante. Present teacher, good night. Good night, Rina Marisabel Álvarez de Chávez. Present, good night. Good night, Roberto Luis Umaña Orellana. Sabrina Mabel Latín Castro. Present teacher, good night. Good night, Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present teacher, good night. Good night, William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Present. Joseline Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present, good night. Good night, 
Alan Christopher Abrego Orizuela. Present. Carolina Ivette Romero Avelino. Present. Good night. Good night. Johnny Vladimir Portillo Chávez. Present teacher. Good night. Good night. José Alfredo Sandoval Sarabia. José Ángel Martínez Hernández. Juan Marcos Guzmán. See you tomorrow, guys. Ya se fueron. Ok. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Good evening, William. ¿Cómo estamos? Good evening, teacher. Muy bien. Bien. Es primera vez que estamos en, en sesión privada, ¿verdad, William? Uh -huh. Bien. Fíjate que a mí me gusta iniciar estas sesiones con, con dos preguntas bien. Bueno, la primera vez que estamos reunidos así. Eh, uno, eh, ¿cuál ha sido tu experiencia con el inglés? ¿Si ya lo habías estudiado antes? ¿Cómo te has sentido en la clase en ese sentido? Y la segunda, ¿qué estamos haciendo aparte de recibir las dos horas de clase? ¿Estamos haciendo algo por aprender más rápido? Y si en realidad eso lo necesito, ¿verdad? o sea, es como, si en realidad necesito que estoy haciendo parte de la clase para mejorar a diario. Ah, ok. Eh, sí, yo estudié en la, en la universidad. Fueron como... Era requisito, la verdad, entonces para poderme graduar, entonces tuve que sacar los módulos. Uh -huh. Y ahí me quedé. Y este... La U, es... ¿La U te daba los módulos? Sí, en la universidad sacamos como lo básico, se puede decir, porque eran 10 módulos. Uh -huh. Ajá, e igual, así como que un mes. ¿Un mes por módulo? Similar. Ajá, era similar, igual, así como acá. Híjole, ah, pero todavía no te... O sea, te faltaba como un año para graduarte y... Tenías que sacarlos. Ok. Sí. Ah, y ajá. Entonces ahí, ahí yo lo saqué y era igual que era como que la suma con la carga de, el, de los estudios y toda la cosa. Así. Uh -huh. Y okay. qué hago aparte es, sí, yo trato de, no mucho la verdad para ser honesto, ¿va? pero sí, o sea, como que en las aplicaciones, en base a la música. Ok. Y seguir muchas cuentas. En inglés, eh, como que nos dan los tips y toda la cosa. ¿Qué app estás ocupando para hacer? ¿Qué red social ocupas para seguir cuentas? En TikTok, sí, sí sigo algunas. Y también uh -huh. estoy usando ahorita una que me ha usado mucho, que es en base a la a música, que es de complementar. ¿El que le de... di? ¿Se lo di, creo? No, Lyrics Training. Mm, ya le digo cómo se llama. No me acuerdo en realidad. Eh, se llama Sounder. Sounder. Es muy bueno. De verdad. Fíjate uh -huh. que a mí una doctora, en, una doctora en inglés, una amiga que es doctora en inglés, me recomendó eso. Es, uh, imagino que va a ser similar a lo que tú, tú dices. Eso es lo que es bien adictivo esta cosa. Es. Sí. Lyricstraining.com. Eh, Ah, ah, sí, ya la, la he usado también esa. Sí, sí esa, porque tienen un... Um, una biblioteca bien extensa de canciones y recientes, que es lo que Ajá. a la mayoría le gusta también en canciones viejitas. Eh, y lo otro que ahorita yo les estoy recomendando es una página que se llama Ron Chang. Yo siempre al, al inicio de los módulos hago eso, darles esos dos links, porque, a ver, ¿qué es lo que más te cuesta a ti que sentís que siempre flaqueas en ese sentido? Eh, pues igual el, el nuevo vocabulario okay. eh, porque sí de entender siento que entiendo la mayoría uh -huh. pero igual la falta de vocabulario es uh -huh. bueno mire el vocabulario es, es lo más fácil desde un sentido de práctica o sea si tú, si tú te aplicas y agarras una disciplina por ejemplo, eh, te acabo de enviar ese link de Ron Chang. Ahí vas a encontrar más de 250 audios con su texto. Entonces, eh, ¿qué haces? Pues imprimís el texto lo, o lo escribís en un cuaderno y agarras un texto por semana. Los primeros dos días educas el cerebro y no a la boca. Entonces, callado, solo andas escuchando y vas leyendo con la vista nada más. No entendiste algo. O te gustó cómo sonó. Mm te regresas, ok, y sí, clavado en que el cerebro entienda el sonido de las palabras del audio y las adapte a la vista, que es el eterno problema, tu cerebro va a estar dándose duro por leer 
tal cual lo ha aprendido hasta ahora. Si ve que dice property, así lo va a leer en lugar de property. Property, dice property. Y así, ¿verdad? Eh, no sé, otros ejemplos. Siempre va a querer leer como lo ha aprendido hasta ahora. Es normal. Entonces, lo primero, votar esa, esa brecha. Tercer día, empiezo a hablar. A hablar, no a entonar como lo hacen ellos. Tal vez lo puedes intentar, voy a tu nivel, ya más o menos ya hablas bien. Entonces, escuchar y leer apegado a lo que están diciendo. Y tratar de entonar. Porque siempre son conversaciones entre dos personas con un tono natural y eso es lo que me llega de esa página. Después de una semana de estar con el, con el audio y la lectura, y vas a decir, pues una semana por audio, ¿sí? Sí, vas a encontrar mucho vocabulario. Y regla de oro, no traduzcas nada. No traducir. Eso me, me ayudó mucho. Yo aprendí desde los siete con un diccionario y esa fue la metodología que apliqué. Lo que hacía al final era grabarme, claro, yo con una grabadora y un cassette. Y me grababa. Y de ahí me escuchaba. Y me comparaba con lo que había escuchado. Dije mal esto. Dije mal esto. Ey, qué chido me sale esa palabra. Le hablo rápido. Ok. Hey, mira, es tan entretenido. Porque aprendes a hacer algo que quizás desde pequeño te dijeron que estaba mal. Hablarte. A vos mismo. Hablar con vos mismo. Escucharte lo que decís. Escuchar lo que pensás. No sé si te haces eso, pero a veces a uno lo pueden tiltar de loco, pero es un bonito ejercicio escucharte, aprender a, a apreciar cómo hablas o despreciar cómo hablas a veces. <risa> <risa> Dios mío, dije más mejor, no lo puedo creer. <risa> y ahí te vas corrigiendo. Yo venía de Santana diciendo las una, imagínate, las una. En a mi prima con mucho amor, ¿cómo? La una. <risa> <risa> y no se me olviden esas cosas así ¿Ah, es lo mismo ¿no? entonces en ese sentido lo mismo puedes hacer con las canciones te gusta una canción, agarrarla toda la semana primeros dos días son escucharle entender la letra, tercer día empezás a repetir no, no cantar, una canción no te va a dar entonación, hay que tener claro eso y ¿qué más te voy a decir? ah vocabulario no lo puedes aprender solo. Es decir, no puedes forzar tu cerebro a que se memorice la, y de que se lo memorice cinco verbos todos los días. No. Dale contexto. Dale contexto. Ok, me quiero aprender el verbo jump. Que no se me olvide que quería decir jump. Saltar. Ok, lo voy a ocupar con otra palabra. Jump. Cuerda. ¿Cómo do you say cuerda en inglés? <risa> rope. You say ro rope. Uh -huh. Rope. Rope. Ok, jump, rope. Ok, tengo un verbo, una palabra. Empiezo. ¿Cuál tiempo gramatical me está costando? Voy a empezar con el presente simple. Bueno, I jump the rope every day. He jumps, dijo que tercera persona se modificó el verbo. Ajá. He jumps the ropes every day. The rope every day. He jumps the rope every day. He doesn't jump the rope every day. Ok, lo más importante lo remarco, lo hago con colores, porque al cerebro le encantan los colores. Entonces... Ese ejercicio de positivo, negativo, pregunta, pregunta abierta, si querés, la task question, si querés. Si tú te quieres disciplinar, hace eso. Verbo, palabra. Positivo, negativo, pregunta. Siguiente verbo, siguiente palabra. Positivo, negativo, pregunta. Claro, voy alternando los sujetos. Agarro el lunes, el presente simple. El martes, el pasado simple. El miércoles, el presente perfecto. Ya a esas alturas del intermedio, ¿no? Entonces, agarro los modales el viernes. Y ahí ya me llené toda la agenda. Hago los cinco verbos y las cinco palabras todos los días. Y ya, voy cambiando verbo, voy cambiando palabra, ¿verdad? Día por día. Y lo voy aplicando en diferentes tiempos gramaticales. Ahí les envío dos listados. Uno de verbos, otro de adjetivos. ¿Qué más? Ajá. Dos de verbos y uno de adjetivos. Entonces, agárrate de ahí. Si realmente te urge aprender, si tienes necesidad de mejorar tus ingresos, aprender inglés, es la manera más fácil de hacerlo. ¿No you think? Yeah. <laughs> ok, so hagamos así cualquier cosa y estoy en el chat. Me puedes enviar un audio si querés practicar. Grabate 30 segundos, no más 30 segundos. Es decir, what do you do every day? Decir, every day I go to work, I start work, at tra -ra -ra -ra. Ok, me lo envías y yo te lo mando de regreso con las correcciones. Ok, chivo. Chivo, chivo, gracias. Ok, William, estamos a la orden. Enjoy your night. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.